Hi everyone, I am Asta and today I'm going to talk briefly about the Atlassian data scientist interview process. At the end of this video, you should have a good understanding of the process itself, what interviewers filter for and several tips on preparing yourself for this interview. So quick intro, I am from Prepfully. This overview has been put together by Atlassian data scientists who are also interview coaches on Prepfully. The very same ones who have helped hundreds of candidates with mock interviews and advice. So this is a video version of our much more in-depth written guide which we link to within the description. And you can always book time with the coaches directly for more personalized guidance on Prepfully's website. Right, on to the overview. As a part of the Atlassian data scientist interview, the candidate will need to go through three primary rounds. First is a recruiter screen. Second round will be a technical round. And the final stage of the interview process will be a virtual on-site interview consisting of multiple different interview rounds. Now let's talk about step one first, the recruiter screen. This stage is divided into two rounds, a recruiter screen and a behavioral interview with the hiring manager. Now the recruiter screen. Recruiter screen is where the recruiter will ask general questions about your background and provide an overview of the whole interview process. The next stage is the behavioral interview with the hiring manager. Okay, The manager will ask questions about why are you interested in this company and what are you looking for in your next role. The manager will also talk about their background, the history of their team and the current needs of the team. Okay, so now we have five tips for getting through this round. Prepare specific examples from your past projects or experiences that align with the skills and the qualifications that are required for this role. Organize your thoughts in advance around topics like what was your contribution and how things went and what could you have done to improve things. Keep your answers short and crisp. Have a clear reason for why you're applying at Atlassian as well as why you think that you'd succeed there. This round often starts with the old favorite. Tell me something about yourself. So it is very useful to have a nice and short intro ready to roll with. Next up is step two, the technical round. The next round of the interview process will focus on assessing the candidate's technical skills. For instance, the interviewer will assess the candidate's SQL, Python and other coding skills through a series of assessments and questions. Some candidates also reported facing product case questions along with the technical questions. Now we have two tips for this round. A. Demonstrate your knowledge of statistical methods such as regression, cluster analysis, hierarchical line, linear models, social network analysis, text analysis, longitudinal methods, etc. Highlight your expertise in SQL and proficiency in another data programming language such as Python or R. The third and the final stage of the interview process will be a virtual on-site interview consisting of multiple different interview rounds. The four most common types of interviews at this stage are generally as follows. Number one, values interview. You will be interviewed by someone who is not a member of the team. You are interviewing for or any adjacent team that your prospective team will be working with. The focus of this interview, therefore, will be on understanding your values and how they align with the company's culture. Number two is a business case study. Now, this interview will be a business case study where you will be asked hypothetical questions to test your understanding of the business or the domain that is related to the position you are interviewing for. For instance, one candidate reported that they were shown a user growth graph and asked, why do you think that it looks like this and what could be some underlying factors? Number three, advanced SQL assessment. This will be an advanced SQL assessment that will include questions involving aggregate and window functions. Number four, stakeholder interview. Now this interview will be a stakeholder interview with mostly behavioral questions on past projects and experiences working with teams. The interviewer will likely be someone you will be working with in the future. Please note that these are just some of the examples of the rounds that you could face. However, the rounds can be different for different roles and different positions. So here are some tips for this round. 
reflect on how your personal values align with the company culture as this may be a topic of discussion during the values interview. Brush up on your knowledge of SQL, aggregate functions and be ready to give specific examples of how you have used them in previous data analysis. Now consider how you handle conflicts or disagreements with managers or teammates and be prepared to provide examples during the interview. Good. That is all from us. Once you feel ready for some practice or just want a sense check of your preparation level, especially on custom rounds such as a stakeholder interview, you can book an anonymous mock interview with a data scientist from Atlassian on Prepfully. And we have included a link in the description below. In addition to that, I have linked a bunch of useful resources in the description, most of which are free. And there's a written guide. There are several interview questions. And if you have follow-up questions about the interview, ask in the comments below. And if you found this video useful, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks and good luck. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, please subscribe. Our website is prepfully.com. We've got lots of interview questions there. You can also schedule a mock interview with one of our experts. You can find the link in the description below. All the best from us at Prepfully, and we hope you totally rock your interview.